nope, I'm gonna get copyrighted if I sing that. How are you guys? Hope you're doing good. Hope you can't hear my AC. It's really loud. I don't know why it's so loud. I have this consistent issue in my life where I have days that I'm like in the mood to get ready, you know? And I'm in the mood to like look better than normal. And so then I get ready for no reason. When I'm done getting ready, I realize that I just got ready for no reason. And then it bothers me because I'm like, okay, well, what was the point of me getting ready today? Like somebody needs to know that I got ready today. And then I force my friends to take Instagram photos of me so that the world knows that I got ready that day. Here's the problem. I'm having one of those days. I got ready this morning for no fucking reason. Like, why am I wearing makeup right now? I texted my friends and was like, hey, like, let's take Instagram photos today. Cause like, that could be fun, right? Cause we're all bored. Well, they didn't respond to me and it's been an hour and I'm impatient and I want an Instagram photo. That sounds fucked up. I like taking Instagram photos because I like wearing fun outfits and getting creative and like, whatever. That's the main reason why I love Instagram is because it's where I get to like express myself with my fashion or just like post random shit. I mean, it's not always fashion. It forces me to get creative with my outfits. It forces me to like get ready and like look better than normal. Like it's fun. I think it's like fun. I don't really put a lot of pressure on it. I just like to have fun with it. But here's what we're doing today. Cause you don't know what we're doing still. Cause I'm not good at YouTube. Okay. Today I thought it'd be fun if I tried to take Instagram photos of myself, but make the photo seem like someone else took it for me. Does that make sense? Because I'm not all about that timer cam life. My goal today is to take photos of myself that people would not think were taken on timer cam. Because I wanna post on Instagram. I got fucking ready today for nothing. Like I wanna make it worth it for me. I recently bought some new clothes. I wanna fucking put them to use. Like let's get an Instagram photo out of this. I don't wanna go in public. Like I don't want anybody to see me taking photos of myself because there's just like no way I can deal with that type of discomfort. Basically the challenge of today is I'm gonna try to successfully take Instagram photos of myself that make it look like my friends took them for me. This is a challenge video. <laughs> so to YouTubers or sometimes. Or is this like just me like being stupid? I don't know. I think this could be fun though. I think I have a tripod, a phone tripod that we could use for this so that the phone is like a less propped up angle, like it'll have a more organic angle. I think I have a tripod, let me look. I might not though, so let's see. Oh my God, yes! I do have a tripod. I might have to go, oh fuck, I just broke it, Jesus Christ. Let's see if I can detach this. Oh fuck, that is one, wait, I might be onto something. Guys, my Instagram content's about to go crazy. <gasps> Stop, holy shit. Okay, let's get into it. Let's change into a uh, fun outfit and then try to get creative. I'm outside on my, I have two decks in my apartment. I actually have three. Oh my God. Okay, I have a lot of options today. I'm wearing a eh, outfit. I'm really unamused by it. I kind of hate it, but I was in my closet for like 40 minutes and hated everything. So that was kind of like, we didn't really have a lot of options. This fucking tripod though is genius. I, I absolutely give myself credit for this. Ooh, what if I sit on this? That's cute. Okay, I'm gonna try. Oh God, I'm embarrassed. Wait, that could've been cute. Okay, low key, this is actually my new thing. I'm embarrassed. What am I fucking doing? Oh, I'm cringing. I'm cringing because I know that like, posing for Instagram photos, ooh. Ew! Let me do a smiling one. I feel like I never smile on my Instagram. Oh fuck. <laughs> Dang it. Oh wow, that was a very natural candid. Let's see how these photos are looking. Oh my God, they're so dark. You literally can't see me. What the fuck have I just been doing for the past 10 minutes then? What if I take like a video and then screenshot from the video? Is that like too obvious? Yay! Being fake happy for Instagram. That's what it is, right? The quality is terrible. Fuck, I definitely fucked that up. Oh, I love Instagram. Ah, uh, okay. Wait, these are better. Wait, kind of good. Like, that's cute. Okay, wait, we might have an Instagram post on our hands. I just might have to spend another three hours doing this, but like, that's fine. Oh, fuck. I'm taking a video right now, and then I'm gonna screenshot from it if that works. Although that's kind of unpredictable, so we'll see. That was fun, but let me edit up the photos. Let's see what we ended up getting. This is the most conceited YouTube video I've ever posted. LA changed me. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, we're back. I just edited all of the photos. So basically my general consensus is that number one, the quality is bad. So that's kind of annoying. Like I feel like the photos don't look as crispy as normal. 
Also, the framing is awkward. Like, why am I like sometimes on the bottom of the screen? Sometimes I'm like just way too like smack dab, smack dab, smack dab in the middle. Like, I mean, I guess I would post one, but I feel like I just know too much. Like, I know that I took these myself and I'm embarrassed of that. So I would never post these. But my goal today is to get a postable Instagram photo. This first try didn't work out and I just fucked up. They, they just aren't good. Um, well, I'm not giving up. I'm gonna try two more outfits in two more locations. So I'll give myself a chance. It would be a lot easier if one of my friends would just fucking hang out with me and take photos. So um, next outfit, I'm wearing a turtleneck. It actually looks cool, but it is also 90 degrees outside. So like, why am I doing that? Anyways, let me see where the lighting is good. Nope, this lighting's shitty. Okay, mm, that lighting's ass, but I'm gonna try to make it work. Oh, ew, I'm so cringy, I'm sorry. I don't wanna hear it. I'm trying to be happy for Instagram. Okay, let's see if I've gotten anything good. Okay, wait, these actually look a lot more realistic. Wait, these are like good. Oh my God, wait, this might be an, oh my God, this worked so good. I don't know if you can see this photo, but it looks cool as fuck. You'll see it later. Okay, I'm gonna take a few more and then we're gonna edit these up. I swear to God, I might post these. Do you see me fucking flip around like that? That was embarrassing. I'm done with that. Let's go edit them up. See how they turn out, see if they're postable. I think those might've been postable. Those were sick. Dude, guys. Oh, it's dark. Okay, I just edited these. And like, these are sick. Oh my God, Declan's playing with my microphone. Okay, these are really nice. I really like these. Like, I killed this shit. For once, I feel like I fuck everything up, but this is actually cool. Like this one. Okay, these are definitely contenders, but we have one more outfit. Wow, what the fuck? That's like a good, that's like a really like Vogue ass photo. Like Vogue taking photos by yourself article. I'll shut up now. Okay, one last try. Although I feel like it's gonna be hard for me to outdo that. That photo's dramatic. I'm kind of like nervous to post that. I feel like that's like a, it's a bold statement. I'm gonna go spend another 45 minutes in my closet trying to pick out um, another outfit, so great. Because it takes me 40 minutes to pick out an outfit. Like, imagine it taking you 40 minutes to pick out jeans, um, a turtleneck, and a sweater. But for some reason, I am so not quick at choosing outfits. It takes me an hour. So see you guys in like six hours. I'm in my last outfit. We got some white shorts, whatever, you guys don't care. So I'm gonna go back up on the deck uh, up there because I feel like I could probably make it look like a different location but in the same spot. Also because the lighting up there apparently slays a little bit. So I have this like cute little like alley little area here. If I can get the lighting right, this could be a vibe. So let's see what happens. Okay, update, lighting here is shitty. Um, I'm literally wearing white shorts and I'm on my period. This is like playing with fire, but okay. I feel like I just can't get this right. This could work. I think I found the spot. Sorry, this angle is so shitty. I just like, whatever. Yes, I stand on my tippy toes because I'm 5'5", five five, okay? I'm just, I don't have a lot to work with. I'm not super stoked on this lighting, which means that we need to try more options. Me setting up my fucking camera for 20 minutes, be like. Fake holding the glasses, a classic Instagram move. Ah! That's my cue to stop. This is like the Instagram Olympics. Okay, these have potential. There could be something there, but I need to edit them in order to find out. So let me edit, I'll be back. My, sorry, Declan's playing with his toys at a very bad time. Okay, I'm done editing. This last round of photos, you know what? They didn't turn out terrible. Actually, like the lighting was actually pretty good. The angles were pretty convincing as well. The only issue was, I didn't look that good in them because I wasn't, I just, you know, sometimes you just don't pose right. You know what I mean? I just wasn't getting my angles, but I actually like a lot of these. I feel like these are better like for like an outfit photo. Like I'll just crop my head out. I like to do that sometimes when I don't think my face looks good, but I like my outfit, I'll just crop my head out.
Anyways, I don't hate these. So, but okay, I'm not gonna post those last ones though because they just didn't feel right. Um, but there actually was a winner and I did succeed during this challenge. I, the second outfit wins and I'm posting the photos right now. Okay, I'm gonna post these and then we're gonna see if anybody comments and is like, Emma, who the fuck took these? What if I just captioned the potato emoji? That's like too obvious. Romaine lettuce, baby. Okay, let's read some comments, see if anything sticks out. Okay, no one's saying anything yet about me taking this photo using timer cam. So I think I'm, I think I'm fooling the masses. Literally no one's saying anything about it. Oh my God! That was good. Guys, timer cam who? I don't know her. Sometimes I get scary shit commented on my photos. Somebody commented, if you wanna see a video of a man being then request my main. Somebody commented, are you sweating? Correct, I'm literally responding to this. Somebody commented, do you wear the same jeans in every photo? I'm insulted. That's the end of this video. I feel like I did the damn thing. Well, that's it. That's today's video. I hope you guys had fun. I did. I now know that next time I need an Instagram photo, or not need, that's a strong word. Next time I wanna take an Instagram photo, I like my outfit, but I don't have anybody available to take that photo for me. I have this bad boy, and this thing, this thing works. Oh wait, somebody commented who took them. <laughs> so somebody actually thought that somebody took them for me. Y'all, I am, this is a prank. I'm gonna wrap this up. Um, number one, I love you guys. Number two, you guys are the best. Number three, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, Timer Kim is your friend, okay? And do you know what? And Instagram photos don't fucking matter anyway, so even if, yeah, just, Instagram photos don't matter anyway, so. I will see you guys next week. I love you guys. Follow your dreams. That's a good one. Okay, I'm gonna shut up now. Bye.